during these current events, we should allow ourselves to pause and breathe, but never stop. This is the first time in modern human history that all black lives matter. You can hear it echo from the protests in LA, DC, and Australia, and all of the countries and city that makes up this beautiful world. You can see it in the way that people march, speak, sing, and dance along. But there's a process that goes into a revolution and all that, and that still includes having those moments of healing. So when you pause, and breathe. It gives you time to reflect on all the black lives that were murdered to get to this point. It allows you to pay respect to the ancestors that were breath was forced out of them, to the brothers and sisters that we seen countlessly on screens having their last breath being taken by someone who is supposed to honor, supposed to serve and protect them. When you stop, when you pause and breathe, it doesn't mean you stop. Stopping is the process where you almost allow yourself to pull, allow every part of you to collapse inside an oppressed society that never saw you. So when you pause, you are pausing for the moments to heal. And when you breathe, you are breathing to still know you are alive to keep fighting so you don't stop. Because stopping is not an option. As these current events swirl around you, take that moment to pause. Just so you don't get too consumed. Take that moment to breathe. So you can let all the ones who are still fighting for you, that you believe in them, that you are breathing with them. Start again. But don't you okay. ever stop. Because there is so much more work to do. So allow yourself to pause. And breathe.